And new at 10, a Denver shelter searching for this American bulldog after they say two people came in to look at the dog and then walked out with it. 7 News reporter Lindsay Sablon is live at Max Fund Animal Adoption Center. Lindsay, Denver police are now looking into this case. And they are not calling it a theft right now, but they do have investigators reviewing the case. Workers here say around 1 o'clock, a couple came in posing as potential adopters, asking to walk one of their dogs, Louie, around the neighborhood. But they never came back. Amongst the cages of dogs at Max Fund Animal Adoption Center sits an empty one with the name Louie on it. The American Bulldog's toys and water bowl still there, but she is missing, believed to be stolen. They asked if they could take Louie on a walk. We did take their um, ID. They said they didn't have any keys. They rode up on their bikes, so they left their bike. Here's that bike. 7 News also obtained the picture ID of the woman workers say came in and took Louie. But we've chosen not to show that because police are not calling her a suspect. Some people look at dogs like her, American Bulldogs, to use uh, under fighting circumstances. While we were at the shelter, Denver police responded, taking all the information Max Fund gave us. Workers are pleading for the public's help, worried Louie is suffering because she needs medication three times a day and has now missed her last dosage. My fear is that she's going to get really sick if, if she's not returned to us. I just want her to be okay and be returned to us safely because she's a sweetheart. Max Fund is offering a reward for any information that leads to Louie. They also say she's microchipped here. All that information can be found on our 7 News mobile app. Workers here also tell me that they are reviewing the policy as far as allowing potential adopters to walk dogs during the adoption process and fear this could happen again. Live in Denver, Lindsay Sablon, 7 News.